that's good. That's he giving people opportunity to at least catch the show. Like if you if the first show sold out, you probably get a chance to get. You know. Y'all already know what it is. Breakfast bars episode nine. We are back. I'm your host DJ Young Legend. Nerd Nash. Back. Good morning. Good morning. Good, morning. good afternoon. Good night. I, wherever you at. <laughs> I got my purple on. Last couple episodes I've been kind of gloomy yeah, yeah, with yeah. the grays and the yeah, blacks. Yeah. You give me some little, little energy, little color. life, little yeah. life. Purple city bird game. <laughs> episode <laughs> nine. Be back. It's been a eventful last week or so. It's been a good week. Yeah. We on the road to the tenth episode. We almost it's been a long there. journey. <laughs> it's been a long. I feel like we've done about thirty of these. Yeah, it's been a lot already. Hype. Shout out to Triple S yep. in the building, like making us look really good. He got the kung fu <laughs> robe on. <laughs> Salute to him. Mm. How you feel that? about the feedback of the last episode? Episode eight was good. Um. At, uh, Official hip hop board got people, you know. Got the people talking. talking. We got a we got a lot of feedback for that. Shout out to Elliot Wilson. Yeah, he, he showed us mad. Had us looking he, good. He showed, <laughs> us, he showed us more love than I expected. Yeah, he did. I was surprised. Posted us on his uh Twitter. Twitter, his sp- IG. Did screen. he pin us? He did for like two days. Oh, he pinned us. Oh, he did he unpinned us. Yeah, he had to get his <laughs> shit off. You know, I respect it. He had yeah, to get you, you know, you gotta keep his keep time curated. He, he let us he let us breathe for like two days. He definitely was tapped in, you know. I'll take that. Hey, we'll get in, we're gonna get into we're that. Gonna get we're gonna that get into sure. the to the final six. The final number, yep. A lot of hate for my man. Who your man? Logic. Oh yeah, yeah. On his own just on him and his half breed project. Was that work from the people or just saying it? From the people. The viewers, a lot of hate for, for <laughs> a lot of What you expected? <laughs> a <laughs> lot of what, like, uh, a little colorism. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. A little, you know, uh, bigotry. You know? Damn, <laughs> big words, bigotry. Uh, a little everything. I seen black people hating on. I even seen his fellow biracial. I did too. Hating <laughs> on him. I see my a little self hate. Yeah, there's a little bit. I have people off. saying his dad. They try to slander his dad. What they say said his dad? dad ain't fully black. Huh? Which he is. I didn't see that. How, how would they know that? <laughs> his dad looks just like Drake dad. So his dad is black. Drake dad don't look full fully black though. I don't know. Something going on in the water. <laughs> the the people, water. people found a way to hate on my guy, which is my guy. He wasn't your guy initially. He wasn't, but he was my guy. <laughs> your guy now. My guy logic. I think it just comes down to he just not cool enough. He's not enough. likable. He's not cool enough. He need like a... Remember back in the day when you go like on, they would go like with Gene Jones, like a makeover. He might be like a makeover, <laughs> a full blown makeover, a stylist, better music. I don't know what he needs, but he don't make the bangs. They're not connected with him. See, when they're you make the bangers, you get the pass. Like Drake, he make the hits so he can say nigga. He could turn this all around if he made better music. He could change, but but he make good music, but he don't. He don't he's not like in that space. Yeah. He can get in the mix. What quick can he, what can lo, what tips can we give Logic on this episode to get in the well, mix or make you know? What do you what do you suggest? <laughs> <laughs> a beard. If he had a beard, oh. if he had some face you had, he would probably get more love from from the from his So it's his, his it's his appearance the, that's really his could, uh, his appearance but I said that looks, I said he looks like a white man. A nerdy white man. That's the issue. He doesn't look cool enough. He might have to change his, which he won't, because he, he doing him. He yeah. doing him. He, he all think to himself. But it's just, yeah. at the end of the day. Does he care? I don't think he give a fuck. We, we care more than he probably cares about this shit. We trying to get, um, make him get a beard and all this shit. He might not care enough. I don't think he care. We, well, yet again, we talking about him. Like three percent. Maybe he room. does care. Maybe when he's alone. Because <laughs> you got to think about it. It's like. See, so we going, we, we, we might go a little too far for this, so pull me back yeah, in. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, the thing when you buy racial, it's you may not be black enough or white for enough. your black side, or right. you may not be white enough kind of in the, in the middle for the white side. So yeah. it's like wherever you kind of lean, yeah, the other side gonna be like, 
Yeah, stay there. Yeah, yeah. So he he's a victim of the stay there. I, I think he's in the middle though. He's trying to lean towards the black, uh, but he's been in the middle <laughs> for so long. It's like he white. You're caught. He man. just don't. I just want people to be honest. He don't make the bangers that you want. Got lock in. He, that's, that would give him the pass to say nigga. If he had some heat, if he was in the mix, <laughs> he could let it fly. If he was in a space where he running around with two chains and yeah, rolling loud over rolling, here, yeah. he would get the pass. But he is what he is. But that's my man. But that's your man. He might the people together. spoke. They spoke. They were loud. And the people saying, "I'm gonna write a big no." No, stamped it. They not, not feeling. They them. not feeling logic saying the N word. So that's what it is. The people spoke. Drake can say it. Damn. J Cool can say it. Drake. They cool. If you're not cool, not being cool. Drake wasn't always this cool. So maybe he could turn around for logic. Now, could the early Drake? <laughs> he was saying it though. But, but say the early. I right, say Drake kept that swag of early Drake. And the cosigns from like little, like see that matters too. He got the cosigns from little. Logic Wayne. don't got, he got strong no cosigns. cosigns. He's got he got paid features on his album. It ain't it ain't, it ain't genuine Sorry, cosigns. My cosigns not strong enough. No, uh, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't <laughs> to it give you the pass. Nope. He need Lil Wayne. Enough. He need Drake. So I guess we'll just close that case as we might revisit this again at a later date. Uh, they not feeling it. I mean, he's gonna continue to, but it's not gonna hit like Drake yeah. N word. Maybe him and Drake need to do Half Breed Volume 2 or something. Another album. Maybe get the co sign that. Well, I don't know. Shout out to. Who was, the other, who was his partner? C. Dot Castro. Shout out to him. Shout out to Where the Half Breed. Yeah. All of y'all. I got the. I, I put the cape on for y'all. I tried. But it is, at the end of the day, yeah, it is yeah. what it is. Wish, wish y'all the best. Wish y'all the best. But the feet, it was mostly, I say 90% hate. It was 90% hate. 10% love. Um, I started feeling bad. Damn. That's what I'm like, bro. I, I, I they came just, out as dead. Yeah, I want to scale it back, but it's like, at this I point. I was like, they call his dad. Have, <laughs> he had breed too. I'm like, hold on, man. <laughs> so I cape for him. Mm-hmm. I got to take the cape off. I but salute to you. Uh, yeah, so that was cool. Um, besides that, we got love. Yeah. We got love. See, I try to. I block out the love. I'm weird. You I don't, block, read the I don't comments. want to hear. You don't go on YouTube. I don't want to hear how fire it is. <laughs> I just want to focus. On to the next. On to the next, yeah. yo. Cause I, I don't. I, want love, to I like the love. I like the love, but it's like you gotta, I had somebody that was telling me, yo, this. I'm like, just relax. <laughs> you got let, this. <laughs> let me focus yeah. on the next episode. Yeah. Let's not start throwing ourselves. We have not done anything nope. yet. We still brand new with this. I told you, and I stick by. We ain't shit yep. until we get to the hundred episodes. We gonna make it there. Uh huh. We almost at ten. We just gotta keep grinding. Yeah. Dude, we gotta grind through the summer too. That's important grind too. Through the summer. What we gotta do? We gotta appreciate the journey. Yeah. Embrace it. We can't think about yeah. the mountaintop. Yeah. We just gotta uh, appreciate every step. Every episode is a win. We can't get gas by Elliot Wilson's post. We can't appreciate you, we but appreciate let's it. not get gas. <laughs> I got gas, so I'ma slow down. I got a little gas. Yeah, I got a little gas you know too. I mean? But I think our supporters were more happy yeah, than, yeah. than I was. I think what it is is we we only on episode what nine, so it's like, like the two. Do what we accomplished, which is not nothing to us, but it is something. So it's like we stood up again. Yeah. So it take a lot to get in front of this camera. Yeah. And, and, and you know, it ain't easy. And talk the shit we talk. Yeah. But it's a new week. Yeah. More shit going on What's in the going rap on? game. It's a lot going on. <sighs> Man, it's always what do you want to talk? I mean, oh. I wanna. Oh, your man, top of the list. AI Drake. AI music, period. AI music, yeah. The shit came. It came shit crazy. Fast. In the last couple weeks, this AI shit this is moving. Chat, what's the shit? Chat GPT. What's the? It's all, all kind, kind of, of shit. Yeah. Mid journey, all kind of shit, but AI specifically. AI rap. AI rap is a genre now. <laughs> it's like ghostwriters and shit. Yeah. It kind of is, yo. AI rap. I done seen. I done seen him do an AI Biggie. <laughs> Wait, I see overshook it. ones B. I saw Drake in the weekend got a banger. That shit is hard. We're gonna touch on Drake because yeah. I've got some thoughts on this okay, Drake. Yeah. But first let's we got I done seen 
AI Ice Spice. Really? I've seen AI Michael Jackson Maybe do Munch. <laughs> a Munch remix. I done seen, man, I done seen all kinds. I done, I've seen a lot. Yeah. Mostly, I'm not knowing, I'm not seeing any other AI music, only rap. Right now, anyway. Is that like, you got conspiracy about that, maybe? <laughs> Possibly. I'm just saying, could it be a tap on hip hop yeah, or something that. like that? I can see that. I can see that. I'm seeing industry people paying again, which they should be. I mean, that's their life, livelihood. Yeah, it's like, yeah, I saw it was like it was a Kanye song too. I think too, right? I think it was a Kanye a song. Kanye, it was a Kanye. I seen AI Kanye. I seen AI. Uh, this shit could be damaging. A, yeah. It could be. See, but the thing is, you don't want to be an old head and fight against the future. This is the future, this bro. Is like some it's here. I think shit, the problem man. is, is it, it's coming so fast. You can really manipulate, and that was. Those voices sound exactly like Drake, exactly like Kanye, exactly like Jay Z, Biggie, whoever it was. That's scary, yo. That's not my. That's not their song, and it sound like their song. All right, well, let's that's get scary. let's get right into AI Drake. Yeah. You heard the songs. Some the draw went weekend. That shit was a It's not bad, it be, yo. It, it need be in rotation. <laughs> I seen people in my mentions saying, "Yo, I put this on my playlist." How you put a fake Drake on your Put playlist? it on his gym playlist. <laughs> You're like, yo, this John Heat. Mm-hmm. It's fire. The Search and Rescue. You think that's AI? It sounds like AI. Yo, could they possibly be leaking these AI songs just to test the waters to see if we'll buy like That can really be Drake, but they're saying it's AI type shit. Like, oh, it's, it's AI, but it's really Drake. Like, really. You know what I'm saying? Check this out. Triple S, get my koofy ready. I'm, I'm about to pull it out yeah, the box. Like, <laughs> but this time, I want the aluminum foil koofy. <laughs> the conspiracy koofy. Shout out to my whole text. I want the, the aluminum foil koofy. Oh, my God. What you got for us? It's something going on. Clearly. Drake AI. Something deeper. For well, him specifically. His AI. I seen, now you know there's whole playlist. There's a whole AI Drake playlist. If so you it's know, more so. additional songs. It's a whole bunch of songs. Oh, no, it's, okay. I don't know, I don't seen it. Like five. Okay. And they sound, if you play this in a car, you I would be like, the difference. I would say this kind of mid, but it sound like something Drake. They sound like out. throwaways. That's why I'm, my conspiracy is, He's put, they're putting it out, but saying it's AI just to test the word to see if we like it or not. That could be my spot conspiracy. Cause it sounds like drop. I, I got three, I got three thoughts about this. One, either somebody out to get Drake. This is a plot against Drake, flooding the internet with all these fake Drake songs. Just maybe Drake this. Yeah. You know Drake is Drake had the game. Most hated. In the Chobo for a long time. Yeah. You know the industry. You know how it goes. Yeah, his ass. They don't yeah. like that. Yeah. yeah. He had the game in the hole for he like. He still got it, but you know, it's a little loose, loose trickle cool now. Could but. it be somebody in the in the shadows? I can see that. Flooding, flooding the internet with these fake Drake songs. So when Drake puts you, you questioning his yeah, music. Yeah, like is this really Drake? Yeah. Yeah. And he's, yeah, that's true. It's possible. That's we possible. got it's people sneaky and sneaky yeah, enough. Yeah. I can see that. To do this. I can see that. That's Second scary. option is Drake is doing this himself. That's my conspiracy. So yeah. yeah. Drake is smart. Mm-hmm. Calculated. Too. Maybe he had he got his hand in this AI thing. I wouldn't be surprised. You see the talking? Yeah, yeah. His name is bubbling, even with the AI. Even with the fake songs, yeah. You see, he, I don't know if this has anything to do with anything, but he just added more shows. Added more tour dates. Four tour dates in Brooklyn. I'm just saying, his name bubbling. Yeah, he hot again in the streets. What's your third one? Third thought. Now, this is, this makes me think. Is Drake so simple that it's just easy to make AI songs off? Is he that simple? Clearly, they can auto generate these lyrics that sound exactly like Drake. Yeah. Does it make you question his pen? That's why I'm going. <laughs> no, because it'd be. If somebody, if, it, the, if the average Joker in his room. It'd be Kanye too, though. 
with Drake. The, okay. If the ahead. average man can pen, <laughs> can pen lyrics, use Drake voice, and you saying this is something Drake would say. Yeah. It is some shit he would say. Does that water down his pen? No, because these AI songs are like dumbed down lyrics. It's nothing like that's articulate flows and like it's the yeah, lyrics is not like Drake. Recently, Drake ain't had, been. Yeah, he not really. He deep ain't lyricist. been really. Yeah, yeah. So is it showing us that maybe Damn. we ain't seen? I ain't seen no Kendrick. And I'll <laughs> play this. Damn, you know, you, how you question his pen off of some fake song? I'm just saying, is it showing us that maybe his pen is kind of... His pen is shaky. It's easy it's just to... It's kind of sim- simple. Yeah. I agree. You I agree with what I'm saying. Yeah, I agree with that. I agree with that. So what do you think? I don't know. I, 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 I kinda, to be honest, too. I agree with all three of conspiracy. We'll never quite know. Because it's easy to... I don't know. I, it's maybe hard to say. we will know. Just yeah. give it time. Something got to, the way it's moving, they all moving fast, so we going to find out what's going on with this shit. But the thing is, you could never tell if the songs are official. See, that, like you said, how are we going to know, even with, if Drake puts out a song, how are we going to know if it's official or not? Like, even if it's a quote-unquote leaks, the leaks of all that might be AIs. Or it could be from, from I his think camp. think Search and yeah. Rescue is AI, bro. <laughs> Maybe these songs but, is half AI. Half of have that's why I said he may be testing the waters to see if we bite on certain songs. Like, oh yeah, this is hot. Then he'll push the button on certain songs and push it to the forefront. Oh yeah, this is official. Or this may not be official. Because he's not making no statement about nothing yet. He hasn't spoken on AI yet. Well, I seen him. Has he spoken on it? He put up, I, I, I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. I seen him put up a, a story post. Mm-hmm. I think he was saying something like, this is getting out of hand or something. Uh, okay. But it seemed like... It was like... It didn't seem authentic. Yeah. Okay. Something going on. That's Somebody sad. playing with us. As long as you don't got AI podcasts, they don't try to manipulate our podcasts, we good. But this music shit is good. It's, it's something deeper to this. Like, it is. It's, it's, I know I'm crazy. No. Uh, Viewers, I know I get crazy sometimes. It's scary. I throw the kufi on, start talking crazy. No, it's just something. It's something going, going on. on with this AI. It's, it's real shit. deep. It's gonna be a lot of money involved in this shit too, at some point. And like I said, the interest, industry people running for cover. Yeah, they got the. the they they put take down notice on certain songs. Because you know, it's so, like if if people could cook up this, it's just fucking the money up. We a lot of people was gonna lose jobs. Mm-hmm. Yep. A lot of engineers and, and yeah. Yeah, you yeah, see what I'm sure. saying, and it's also uh, this also showed me something. A lot of Drake fans easily satisfied because they liking these AI joints. They have yeah. it. They good as long as they don't have no. Yeah. They just want to hear the Drake. music. Is damn this? Yeah, fake Drake or not? <laughs> fake Drake I'm rocking with you. They saying we putting this. I like this. They, I seen people say, "Yo, this is heat." That weekend song is fire. <laughs> I keep saying that shit was hard. So, so fake Drake is making better music than real Drake. AI Drake, I should say. I won't say better, but is he could throw them songs. It, it, he could throw three of them songs in the middle of his album. You know what, Drake? You, wouldn't, you might go, oh, this kind of man. Drake should get in contact with AI Drake and ask for permission to use that, those songs. <laughs> and put them out himself. Either he's behind AI Drake or somebody's somebody. trying to sabotage Drake name. I told you last episode Drake is Teflon, so I don't know if this is gonna work, but we're gonna see. Drake brought a lot of people the wrong way with, yeah. with, with his dominance. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see him letting up, but we'll see. We'll keep you updated. I'm just saying so what how do the how do, how does the hip hop industry fight against this? It's hard to can they do? strike and say, you know what, we ain't putting out no music until y'all figure so this shit out. That, but that they are gonna lose money doing that too. And then guess what just happened? AI just they gonna put the they gonna put the music out themselves. Yeah. You know what I mean. And this is this is making people appreciate Real. all the hip hop we have. You now you noticing? Yeah. It's a big flood of hip hop pages now. A lot of them, yeah. Hip hop yeah. content pages. Yeah, we starting and to, Twitter. Yeah. We starting to appreciate the nostalgic yeah. feel. Yeah. So it's funny how that's happening while AI is coming. Yeah, because this new shit is hard to get a grasp on it. What's what's real or not? So we're gonna have to start marking songs with you know how you do they do the b- before Christ yeah. <laughs> before AI. <laughs> 
before you gotta, AI. You gotta yep. start telling you, yo, this is BA. This is before AI. <laughs> this Bob D. This is before AI. That's crazy. They gotta start, yo. And to differentiate AI songs or not, labels might have to start put some type of uh, uh, asterisk or something next to it, so we know it's official or Apple Music. We gotta put like a star next to a song, so we know it's not AI or some shit. Like I'm, they're probably gonna start doing that. They gotta start doing that. I, I seen somebody tweet and I wrote it down. Somebody said, "This is scary." No, it is. I don't think I like the future. It's here though. The it's future here. is here. This shit it's moving here. fast. We don't know yeah. what's going. That's the beauty of it. We don't know what's going to happen. Yeah. This shit can take down the industry. Oh shit. <laughs> this shit might go crazy. Another thing I wrote down. Could this be the beginning of the end of the rap star? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, because this. Yeah, because this. Could this be the end? It could be, but I don't know. It's, it's like scary. two different. It's like two different worlds. That's what it feels like. That's AI why. That's why I'm shit. deep. I'm deep into my '90s and 2000s bag lately. Yeah, you got to before before AI. Old. Before AI, like I said, we can appreciate that stuff more before the technology and this bullshit that's going on now. Yeah. I got my eye on this. I'm yeah. on the case. We're in the next updated. coming weeks, I'm gonna be. I'm, I'm watching what's going on, but if I had to put my money on it, between somebody being out for Drake or Drake having his hands in it. I think Drake got his hands in this. It might be a mixture. At this point, I he might have Drake to. got his hands in this. You can't fight it. So he might he might have his hands on it. So we'll Like you up. said, he testing the war. To see what we it's like. Some, yeah. It's a piece we missing. It, it'll, come out, it'll come out soon. It'll come out It's a it. piece we are missing. Yeah. I wonder what they saying in these offices. <laughs> in the deep underground. <laughs> I wonder what they saying in these offices. Are they scared? Or are they... They gotta be They Right, it's alarming. But, you know... The shit got to oh, they trying to figure out how to capitalize I see off that too. this. I think I think they gonna try to capitalize off of it. You know? But you you are you're gonna be our AI correspondent. Yes, let us know what's going on. Shout out to Drake. Shout out to AI Drake. I'm not mad at AI Drake. Where you are in the deep I'm dark not letting people calling the stuff whack. I'm amused by it. Yeah, if it was if it was whack, we could come here and say it was I see whack. a lot of people yeah. saying it's whack. Some of the stuff is good, but you like I say you don't want to be the old head hating on the new shit on, yeah. on the future. Yeah. Here you now. gotta roll with the future or you're gonna get left behind. Real talk. You know what I mean? So we'll keep y'all updated. We'll see. I got my eyes with Drake. <laughs> Love the sun. Oh, somebody, <laughs> something going on. We're gonna figure it out. The powers that be. Yep. Shout out to all the AI music. Um, yep. I don't think I heard no AI hove. <clears throat> nah. Not yet. Anymore. People gonna have to step their pen up. Yeah. People. So you can't. You gotta make it so you can't be AI. You can't be AI. If your pen is so strong, the average man can't can't. But I think the thing is, I out. think it's the voice. I don't even think it's the pen. If it sounds like the artist, then it's gonna be easy to fake us out. It's, it's gonna be that simple. So I don't know. I don't think it's the, the you you saying it's more so the lyrics. I think as long as it sounds like that that person, yeah, people gonna fall for it. If somebody try to AI a, a Kendrick, Kendrick pen is a little more. And, and, and Kendrick, if they do this he play with his voice. Game, well, he do. He well, switch voices. They can manipulate that. They can do that. They can be, go in his different pockets. It'll be a little tough. Yeah. Look how easy it is to. That Drake shit was easy. It's too <laughs> easy. <laughs> it was easy. And then how they the lyrics is like Drake was saying this like, shit. Yeah, like A B C D type shit. Yeah. They made it like he was like this some uh, simple. Some Drake. Yeah. Oh man, I don't know, man. Yes, I don't know where we gonna be by summer <laughs> with this shit. Something going, something got to give. They might have uh, AI NBA young boy soon. Something got to give, yo. But whatever. We'll see what's um, going on. The hip hop board. Yep. We got a lot of feedback on that. A lot man. of feedback. Um, I seen a lot of people. <laughs> what? A lot of people wanted. I wouldn't say wanted Joe Button off, but it was a lot of. I was surprised about that. A lot, a lot of people. But you said that initially, you feel like they weren't gonna agree to that, the Joe Button thing. Cause you know he get a lot of people say he get chatty patty, he get biased towards people. But I think when you when you keep it hip hop, yeah, he can keep it fair yeah, aside, or no. Aside from the BS, I think he's pure hip hop, and I feel like he will keep it fair and authentic. And he's been in the game twenty plus years, rapper, podcaster, content creator. He's been around, so his opinion, I think. It's somebody that we could trust and appreciate. So, but a part of me can see how 
<laughs> the people. You know, a, a, a list come across his desk <laughs> and he go, you know how Joe Bunn can get yeah. sometimes. Yeah. But we're going to let him stay in the seat. For now. Because we appreciate he gave us a lot. He did. Music wise and culture wise. A lot, yeah. We're, I'm gonna get into you know. See, you and bullshit. <laughs> See, you got the fans. You think about the other shit. I'm just saying because you. I like to keep it fair all yeah. across the board. I can hear the complaint. But like you said, if you keep it in pure hip hop, we gotta block we, this shit I, out. We gotta block yeah. it out. Yes, a hip hop. Everybody got some shit with him. Everybody. So good. it is what it is. He, he might he might have the most shit with him on the list, but everybody got some. But hip hop wise, he he got enough. Yeah, he, he got enough. His opinion matters. So he's staying. I'm sorry, view, I'm sorry, yeah. the viewers that was getting at me. <laughs> Button got to stay. I had a lot of suggestions. DJ Clue, some people. I oh, seen yeah, a couple yeah. of DJ Clues. Yeah. I seen some big boys. I saw a lot of Snoop Dogg. Um, I seen I seen women saying we need another woman. I saw a lot of that. I seen Rod Digger name come up. Missy Elliott. Missy. MC Light, Queen Latifah. Queen Latifah. Yeah. So, you know what I mean? But everybody can't get on the list. It's, it's a list. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a panel. But, right? you know. My man Legend made an executive decision for this yeah. six member. Yep. You know what I mean? Drum roll. Drum roll. <laughs> we got Hovane number six. You know? Hovane at six. Rest in Rest peace. Hovane. Philanthropist, executive. Business mogul, you know. Before he passed, he made the uh, the billboard list. So you know, I so think we'll have you know, the five seats, then we'll have the honorary honorary seat yep. for whole vein. Yep. You know what I mean? I uh, think I think that's a good you know a good pick. We could have put a lot of people in that you know that list. And I feel like you know giving us him his flowers while he's not here, you know, is important because he probably would have been on that, that that list. You know, he was on a billboard list before he passed. He's one of the top executives in the game. And so. he would definitely keep it fair. Yeah, and that's his, yeah, he, he wasn't call biased. It fair. Yeah, he wasn't yeah, biased. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yep. yep. he managed the likes of Styles P, Louis Banks, Smoke Dizza, you know, the list goes on. So he had the reputation and, you know, the credentials, you know. So, so I'm shout not mad at that. Shout out to Another name I had in mind, though, Sycamore. Shout out to Sycamore. Yeah. Yeah, that, you know, that, that was a good. But Sycamore, one. Whole Bay, they both. That's together. That's, they, they so both that's, on the list. They, that's both of them. Yeah, that's that's, that's together. That's the same. They that's under the same, the same umbrella. Yeah. So I'm I'm not mad at Whole Vane being in there. So we got Whole Vane, Elliot Wilson, Angie Martinez, Angie Martinez, Bun B, Bun B, and Sway. Yeah. So all these lists and shit, we will be forwarding them to these people. So are we? We should do this. Are we do? Are we keeping this list? 2023, then next year doing another panel, maybe? Are we keeping it like this forever? Um, Is it interchangeable? It doesn't be interchangeable. Like, uh, take Joe Button out and put somebody uh, else in. Well, maybe we can add one. Or add here. somebody else. Or add, yeah, yeah. Uh, one or two members. Let's of do here. that. Yeah, yeah. Make it like that. Yeah. So, anytime I see a list on the timeline, we add, I'm uh, adding, <laughs> straight I'm up. Adding the board and say, hey, look at this. Let us know what you think. You know, you know what I mean? So. Shout out to them. Uh, this, that was dope. I'm not mad at that. Shout out to Whole Vane. Yes, sir. Number the game, six. The game. I wonder what AI, I wonder what Hove would say about AI. <sighs> I know. <laughs> I, I wonder what Whole Vane would say about AI. Yeah, he probably. I mean, it's it's like it says the future, so he probably. Whole Vane will find his way into to the yeah, to yeah, the yeah. AI mix. Yeah. <laughs> he will find a way he, into. He, it. he, he had an AI artist. <laughs> he had an AI artist. For sure. He had it. Yeah. Shout out to Hove. Shout out to the whole Brooklyn. No, for sure. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's a that was a good call. That was a good call. Actually. Yeah. I wonder if the how the viewers feel. I don't we gonna see. We gonna see what they say. You know, you can't you can't go against that. You know, we gonna you know. Oh, they can't. Oh, they can. They, 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 but they can. can. <laughs> yes, we know they can. But you know, I think it was in good taste. So it was in good taste. So, um, yeah. Shout shout out to the board. Uh, shout out to Elliot again because he was the only one that showed us love. But I looked at it like. He's one of the top voices in journalism. But they the all game. saw it. Everybody, Everybody saw, saw it. Everybody saw it. So him to co-sign it. They saw it on his page. They saw it from us. So however they can say act like they didn't see it, but it's like he co-signed it. So that meant that was good enough for me. So not mad at that. Um What else we got here? Uh let's see. Um I wanna salute Mason Cam. They got a great show. On a great show, it, it is, is what it is, what it is. sports show. Yeah. They were my heroes coming <laughs> up. I can't sure. lie. Definitely. I wanted to be like Mace. 
It's good to see them back together. I kept a, I, believe it or not, I had waves before. I had this ball. Believe it or not. <laughs> yeah. I used to keep a brush in my back pocket. You got a do rag too? Do rag. I, I wanted the mace. Mace had the greatest waves he did. in history, yeah, yeah, yeah. maybe until Fab showed yep, up. Yep, yep, until Fab. A hero of mine's Cam. Yeah. A legend. It's good to see them back together. No, it's, it's, it's really good. All the old niggas happy to see Cam and Mace yeah. on the screen. That chemistry is crazy. The chemistry. They grew up funny. together. Yeah, they, they, they know each other. They each other. Yep, yep. You know what I mean? Good to see. It, it makes you think, like, damn. What I, if? What if Damon Hove could get the, like, yeah, uh, that never happened. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, it just feels good to see them. Um, yeah. They, and it's good that they're doing sports because they don't have to worry about the politics yeah, of the rap game, yeah. and having to deal with yeah. getting gas. It puts them in a different lane too, so it's and like it's easy to embrace them. The, the, the sports people to embrace them, yeah. you know, you know, hip hop, yeah, hip hop finicky. So yeah, they in that sports lane. So it's they... good to see. It's, it's probably one of my favorite shows. Yeah, I love it. It's funny. I love to watch. Um, I wish they would have got this shit together years ago, but maybe it's time, man. It's good to see so, them now. It's, you know, perfect. So. it's good to see them a little older. More mature, older. Yeah. Little season. Yep. You know what I mean? They're both funny. Mm -hmm. They can get that bag, that podcast bag. You know so what I mean? mean? Cam was with, Cam was with uh, Diddy the other Cam day. Was with Diddy. I seen Cam. He did an uh, interview with some show on Barstool, Sports oh, yeah. Baby Day. Yeah. Yeah. Trying to get him. I think Revolt might be trying to get him. Boss Barstool looks like they're trying to get him. No, Probably a little bit know. more going on. So shout out to them. It's good to see. Uh, I just, uh, the washed up man in me love to see old. Yeah. Well, older. Older. Rappers getting in there. You see. He threw what? a little. Jim, all right. So Jim Jones was on Breakfast Club. He threw a little salt in the game. Still, he Jim don't like, he still like Mace. Salt. He still don't like Mace for whatever reason. Him and Cam is whatever. They only, but you know he wish he would. Ain't no way he don't want to be a part of uh, uh, uh He's looking at it like, these motherfuckers. I don't understand the, the gym hate on Mace. It's like, if Cam and Mace could get along after all these years, why are you still holding a grudge against Mace? What did he do to you? Like, he didn't show up to horse the carriage for Cam. What did he do to Jim Jones to make it not, you know? And it's just crazy how Mace and Cam, you know, they they having fun being regular yeah. guy and Jim still He's being still tough cabo. To, yeah. Running around, I, being... You know, you Running see, with Bano and these I just thought people. about it. I think Jim wants a podcast. He thinks he's doing all this dissing, Pusha T, dissing Mace. Mm. I think he wants some content. You think he's trying to set up? I think he's trying to set his own, put put his foot in the game. And this is the way he's doing. His way of doing it. We keep talking about him from the Pusha T to the now talking about Cam and Mace. I think he's trying to get this uh, podcast in space. I don't want to see. I, Jim I'm, Jones don't need to be tough no more. Yeah, this is in 2005. Like, this is this, blood, blood. We know yeah. you the Koofy Smacker. Yeah. The Goonie. Yeah. Bird Gang. Yeah, Don't relax. you just wish you could just relax and get with Cam and, them and joke and laugh? That's my main thing. Y'all are all older, 40 plus, like mature adults at this point. Hold on to Grandis and Beef in 2023 makes no sense. Then he's still doing his, his little push it. I don't know what's up with him and push it T. Push is he gonna get at him on this uh, you think album, so? on this gangster grills? He's gonna say something about this. You can't not say something gonna, about this. I don't think it'll be a diss song. It'll be he he'll throw a little line you got catch. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that. Jim Jones asking for it though. But I think it's it's he he's, he wants the content from it. He want, he's trying to get a pod. It looks like he's trying to get a podcast from this shit. He's trying to get like a deal or a situation from out of this. And he's still pushing the narrative that push the T is. Pusha T fans got at me on the timeline a couple of days ago. What did you say? Because I said, and this is just from my word ain't, ain't golden. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll just say, I remember I used to be on the hip hop forums back right. before the blogs. Right, yeah, yeah. I remember the clips being kind of, they wave was a little more internet. Oh, for sure, than yeah. Than street. After, right. after grinding. At, like the, uh, the re up game time, that's when they started. More blog That's what I'm internet. saying. People, yeah, I, I, I blocked like ten people from VA <laughs> from VA on Friday. They like, no, you don't know what you're talking no, about. No, you're right. You're right. I'm That's like, true. bro, I remember grinding yeah. was lit. Yeah, of course. And then yeah. they kind of they it's, went underground in the reup gang. Ed Live was saying, and they was yeah. getting love in the forums. For sure, yeah. It was like you know their allegiance with Pharrell. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
And it was kind of an underground. I'm not saying it was whack. It was, un- yeah, it was like they still had the mainstream love, but they went more underground mixtape. They did the mixtapes. Yeah, and real, it was yeah. kind of internet. Yeah. For a while. I don't say hype. Yeah. But love. Yeah. I wasn't hearing no niggas like that. Not when Jim, not. I'm just a dirty woman in Delaware now. <laughs> so you take that for what it's worth. But, we, but I was moving around Philly, New yeah, York. Yeah. Clips wasn't being pumped like that. Yeah, Dipset had that shit a lot. To, to fuck with them, you had to kind of be in the know of the yeah, internet culture was going and on. sneaker heads yeah, and yeah, all that yeah. type of shit. It was Dipset. Yeah, they had shit a lot. And fucking. Everybody else. Well, G, was, G Unit. And, and then the South was popping. Mm-hmm. Yep, TI and all them. Yep. When Pusha showed up with. Yay! That's, that's when it came back. And then around. people started to revisit. Like, yo, the clips was like that. Yeah, yeah. That's just what I remember. People telling me I'm dead wrong. No, I mean that's just that's just how I remember it. No, but Jim Jones saying all that, you can't name five. He, that's when he started to throw the he yeah, throwing it's extra it's songs. It's disrespectful on. now. It's like, all right, you didn't think he should build a list, but then you saying we can't name five songs. It's like, all right. So, well. Can you name five songs? I can, but can the average listener? No, because they they're more so clips fans too. I mean, see, Pusha T is a hardcore. You have to be a kind of into hardcore lyricism, drug rap, to lyricism, really yeah. be. The casual fan doesn't know. See, I'm not. Five songs. I'm not a hate. I'm not trying to make it seem like I'm hating on Push, but like, I feel like. Pusha kind of acquired, he, he acquired taste almost. Oh, like, he is, yeah. And he's not really that super mainstream. But he's like, super nice. Yeah, yeah And Jim yeah. Jones said he's super nice. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Jim, he, this, is not, this is a battle he don't want, though. It's not a good battle for him. Now, see, because the thing about Push, Push is, push is just sit back and let you talk crazy. So that project, I'm come out. And then he'll, he'll, he'll bomb. He'll, he'll say something. He'll, he'll bomb something. on you respectfully. I don't know. I don't know. He disrespected Drake. So I don't know. Yeah, but Drake, you know, Drake went a little too far. He messaged his wife and all that. Yeah, that, that, yeah, yeah, yeah. Jim Jones more keeping in his opinion. Push your spank him, yeah, yeah, but he yeah. won't bomb on him. That's his mob. Maybe he will, you though. Might, you might try to kill him. You know, you might try to, you know, bury him. This is going to be interesting next couple, couple months. We'll I just wish Jim, I, I want to see Jim Jones laughing. Oh, you want, Jim, you want. I want to see him laughing and smiling with Mason and Cam. Yeah. We like I said, we know you the cool, we know you talk. You and Harlem were together. <laughs> you, <laughs> you gotta be tired of running around with with Maino and, and all these tough Lobby niggas, boys. You know, like yeah. Lobby Boys. Yeah. Which was not a bad. That's a good project. project. <laughs> it was really good, yeah. If y'all haven't listened, that Maino and Jim Jones. Yeah, Capella Gray on there. He has some good songs. I know some of y'all saying Maino and Jim Jones. That's a good combination. It's not bad, yo. Yeah, it's, it's not mad, bro. I'm just saying. He gotta be tired of being tough, yo. Cam don't gotta be tough no more. Mace, Mace wasn't really ever tough. They can be lighthearted, laugh, joke. And I think Jim has a personality where he could he could do that. We see him before. We've seen him do it before. We know he can so do he can, it. <laughs> lock in, have fun. Make the call, Jim. Call Cam. Say up. yo, man. I'm sorry. I'm coming on the show. <laughs> you, Bring me on the show. Like, swallow your pride. Call like yo, Cam, man. Watching y'all is making me think about. Our, Back in the day, how we was kicking it. I miss y'all. I'm, I I called to say I miss y'all, yeah. man. Can I be a part of the show? Yeah. I already <laughs> did the weather. I have my own. Let me do yeah, the weather. Yeah, yeah. Let me do the weather on the oh, show. Let me do something. I can add. They would love to see all three of us. But like you said, sometimes that pride can get in the way. Come on, fuck that, that, man. Do it for me, man. Do it for me. I was a big Dipset fan. Yeah. Come on, do it. We. I don't want to see you tough no and, more. And think about that tough guy shit. A lot of your homies is already in jail. A lot of your homies is dead. You are by yourself, so it's like, what's the point of doing the tough guy shit now? You know I'm how that you know, it turns out. So. Saying, uh, he gotta be thinking this. He seen his lane. He he probably watching and can see I should be the third person on here. That's what makes me. That's what makes me think he's doing this for that reason to get in that podcasting space. So well, he definitely got the people talking. So yeah. like like we always say, the people talking, he's doing working. something yeah, right. Hate it or love it. We'll see what happens. He did a good job. Um, so, so that's that with that. We, we happy about Mason Cam. No, for sure. Well, I am. No, I am. No, for sure. Um, you, you man? Oh, shit. Money bag? No, yeah, yeah. That's my man. Oh, I'm just checking. <laughs> that's my man. Even though lately I wasn't listening. I ain't listened to 
his recent stuff. I don't know why. Yeah. It, it, he got some shit. I ain't got nothing bad to say. I just wasn't listening. But he dropped a video for Motion God. Yeah. It's like a... Uh, it got the cash money. It's like an old to like cash money Lil Wayne type of situation. Being then is the cars, the, the money, blink And once again, the old nigga in me... It felt good to see that. Yeah, he paid homage. To see them giving props to the cash, to the, the white yeah, tees. Yeah, the bandana. The bandana. That was hard. Yeah. The oversized jeans. The song not that bad either. No, the song fire. The whole fire too. Yeah. Money bag yo can rap. I just hate sometimes when he, he take the social media line. The TikTok type, the current events and he, make it a song. But they become hits because of that. So you master that well, shit. I'm feeling that. That, that's, that made me anticipate the album he got coming. He said you got something coming up. Motion soon. God is fired. The yeah. video is fired. We check just that out. check it yeah. out. Like oh, what's that from? The Bling Bling video. Yeah, that shit was dope. They need to bring that whole stuff, that whole wave he back. Why be trying to do that? Like the the, the five X shirts. Bring it back. Rebox. Bro. Bring yeah. it back. <laughs> that show, look, they look. They yeah. look great. Like it look like it look good. Yeah, if you can bring it back, it will look cool it today. Look cool. Yeah. It don't look crazy. Wait, so would you wear that today? A four or five X? If, if, if they brought it back. Well. <laughs> You're I'm a little older, age. yeah. You're a certain <laughs> age, so I don't know. I got a daughter that's 16. <laughs> I, I can't. You can't drop her off at the games. But the young, the young <laughs> niggas, 18 to 25. So push shiesties and five X shirts. Jump back into the tall tee. For us, do it do for it us. For us cause, cause we can't do it. I ain't gonna lie, them Memphis niggas look good with that with that swag. I'm like, yo, these, that should that be shit a, hard. They need to run with that. They should bring it back. I'm not mad at that at all. Speaking, it was good to see. Speaking of Memphis, this is not on the topics, but where the hell has Black Youngster been? Is he still down with them CMG? I don't. He been quiet. I don't know what's going on with that nigga. He got cases. What? <laughs> what's the look? He been quiet. Do we got cases? Uh, see, I don't know. He got. He got intel. <laughs> I don't know where he is. I don't know where he is. I played the film. I don't know where, where he's at. I hope he's safe. You know, out of harm's way. Yeah, I hope he's safe. Yeah, I guess, I guess Glorilla took his took his spot. Shout out to Glorilla, yeah. Shout yeah, to she gonna shout out to the to the women rapping. It was a lot of women rappers, yes, but they been having some shit this week. Again, this is not the topics, but Lotto and Coil Ray had an issue. It's a lot going yeah, on. Yeah, that was what she called Coil Ray, a skinny <laughs> blunt. <laughs> some shit. But body shaming, that's the thing. But so, she, I don't think she meant to diss it, but we. But if Coyle Ray feel away about her body, the, she could take it. The last the thing year, is, when you say something, you can't tell nobody how to feel. The last year or two, people have been saying stuff in lip, rap lyrics about Coyle Ray. She's been having to shoot back at them on Twitter. She, it's, it's a real thing. If you have like insecurities about your body as a woman, and you feel like people taking shots, you go and rep, say, say how you feel. Uh, Lotto she, was, met, she meant no harm. Lotto was at Coachella uh, week two. It said... She said, I love her, your body. So they, they're they cool now. So Does Lotto say nigga in her raps? Yeah. She's biracial. She's a half breed. She does. But it depends on. She's cool. She's a woman of a certain I look. Hate, damn, you say the way you say half breed, that just sounds crazy. I know. But that's the, how you think I feel about Lotto. You're saying, name of this project, half breed. Biracial. She's biracial. So she can say, she got the nigga pass. I, mean, I think saying. her dad is black. Her mom her is white. Black. Yep. Okay. She was on that Jermaine Dupri show. <laughs> she, yeah, I do. My daughter used to watch uh, the rap game. So my daughter watched that from that. Little. See, it's crazy how these these artists come from like these humble beginnings, these quote unquote nerd looks, and then they can like glow up and become like these superstars. You gotta, you gotta. It's like a transformation. You like gotta, how the fuck you gotta they be do a that? superstar. Yeah, you gotta be in you. Yeah, you gotta be really in you. Uh, so you know, that's dope. Yeah, the women. You got ice, shit. ice Spice. She got her. Ice Spice two songs on the Billboard. You know that's from the. That's from the Barb's effect. The Barb's pushed her up. The, the, the Princess Diana is number four come on, on the billboard. Come on, shout out to the Barb's. They that song get, is hard. They get That's the job. Not... Oh, now it's hard. The song oh, is hard. hard. <laughs> oh, all right. The song is hard. Mickey, she might be. All she makes is, be... All Ice Spice make is fire. All she makes is fire, yo. All she makes is fire. And they're real, like, her team's real strategic about certain features, certain moves. They don't they don't put her all over the place. They spread her really like thin. She, she got a, a new a Skims ad with Kim yeah, Kardashian that. just came out that. now. So she keeps so it So now she got, the, she got that Kim K boost. She got the urban. She getting the right boost. Nick strategic. E yeah, she real strategic about what they're doing. She about to own the summer. Like I said. You said this, like, a month or two like ago. Like I said. Yeah. You said, Max be a... Just wait. I, 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 
I thought Max B was supposed to be home. It's in but April. The, the month's not over. And then we still got Gunner, so. Ah, yeah, we got Gunner. I'm not looking forward to none of that Gunner shit. I'm still standing on that. You still standing on it? So you're not going to support him? Yo, he, he's in the wrong. He hasn't said. You know you're the wrong. He's in the wrong. No, he's in the wrong. If he ain't make a statement, he ain't popping out, no music. It was like, you know you did Come wrong. On, you did wrong. We journalists. I ain't saying I was a, a co sign any of the, the I, I'm not saying I co-signed Stitcher. Right. I'm just saying I'm, I'm, I'm right. against him going against his day ones. How about the Scar Scarlet? Okay, so Scarlet. I like her, but what I don't like is when a new artist from New York comes out, the first thing they say is, "Oh, this is that New York. They bring New York back. Why do New York people have to always bring New York back?" It's like they they so what stuck they, on. How is she bringing it back if Ice Spice? Because it's the off the authentic. Oh, it sounds like DMX. It's the real pure hip hop '90s rap. So it's like, and these some of my artists comes out from New York, they making a point to say that like we want that real feel back. I don't understand. What's the real feel? What do you want? Is it, we got drill. We got lyric. We got bars out right now. Yeah, we got lyrics. Back, shit. They want the, but she's not really boom back. She kind of. She's she straight. moved rugged. She is boom back. I guess. I see. seen her in the studio with Busta Buzz. Everybody trying to get a little sauce from her now. Swiss put her on the project. Busta got her on some shit. They try to tap into her. She is the hot new thing, but I like her, but it's, I don't like the let's keep it real authentic New York. That's how you get left behind. We always try to keep it so authentic. And they don't care about none of that authentic shit. They do what they do and keep it genuine to their sound. Mm-hmm. They're not trying to sound like outcast. They trying to sound like 2023 uh, Atlanta. She, I like her though. I'm still... She's new. She only got like two songs. I, I, gotta hear, I gotta hear some more. Because you know how the social media pump They'll pump you up quick. I was telling somebody the other day, I like her, but they'll burn you out. I'm tired of seeing her on social media. Like everybody's posting her. I'm, I'm, I'm with her. I support her, but they'll burn you out. They'll burn us out quick. Everybody wants to post her. Everybody wants to co-sign it. And it's like, give her a chance to grow into who she's supposed to be. Don't put her on this pedestal that she let y'all down. So, well, give her a well, chance. they pump Ice Spice up. Fast, but she she, she lived up to the hype. Yeah, she lived up. She got you got. She's saying food. give it some time. Yeah, give it some. Look, give her, she's young. Give her a little second to breathe. Oh, she was in the club with Fifty Cent the other day. I saw that. Man, he's co-signing her. So that's what's up. I appreciate the co-signs, but give her a chance. We don't know what's going on yet. Give her some time. I seen a clip of her. I didn't clip. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't click on a clip of her. But I, I'm not. Must so animated. <laughs> I'm not, no disrespect, <laughs> but I'm not interested in hearing Busted Buzz, yo. And that's just no, just, that's just my personal. Busted put an album out last year, too. That's, that's just my personal. I'm not saying Busted Wack, he one of the greats, but I just, that didn't make me want to, when yeah, I saw yeah, them yeah. in the studio, that didn't get me hyped to click on it. I just scrolled past yeah. it. Yeah. Shout out to Busted. Shout out to Scar Lips. I did see, if you want her TikTok, mm-hmm. she got... Video, she do a little a close up of her oh, rap. Those are older. She been around. Yeah. She she can rap and she got a story. She yeah. got a, a story behind yeah. her. So oh, for sure, we'll we'll see. We'll we'll see what happened with that. Um, yeah. But shout out to all the women rapping. They saying the women harder than the men. I, I don't know about that. They more consistent. They but they they you know, they doing their thing. They might be harder. I don't know. There's a lot of them. Meat Mill. The Meat Mill Breeds. I seen the Breeds back. back. Is he back? Or is he preparing to be back? Him got the hang time. He's back. But the hang time not there from like 2008. What are we so, doing with Meat, yo? What is he doing? We need to, That's the real question. What is he doing? We don't know. We can't make an a, a opinion or have an opinion yet because we don't know his plans yet. I don't know. We, he got a transformation Transformation with the Breeds. The music. Put out was okay so far. What did he, he was put? in Poland with like Robert Kraft. What's the last thing he put out? He put out a freestyle, I think, on Instagram or YouTube. I didn't see it. Triple S ain't see it. And that's the thing. It. Triple S ain't see it. That's the thing. He has to get the people in his good graces again to care enough about this music. So are the brains gonna bring that? <laughs> what, what are we? I don't know. Is it gonna like put like superpowers or some shit? Like I don't know what's his plan with this. That's your man. That's Philly. I'm, I'm looking to you. He retweeted my tweet, but I said, Meek Mill is growing their braids back. The new music is going to be fire. I spoke that to existence. So that means he I'll, know. So that means he's, he's strategically showing that he got the braids back. He's, this is purpose. He's purposely growing the braids back to bring this sound back, probably that we used to from you know back in the day. This street, you know, authentic sound. 
But I think he's so far removed from it, I don't think he needs to do that. I ain't hear no AI of me. Not yet. <laughs> Makes you think. Why is there no AI of me? They probably writing it right, right now. <laughs> but there's a lot of AI Drake. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Give him some time. The, the ghost part probably in the back. Mm. Cooking it up. He needs some beats. <laughs> I'm AI add, beats. I'm going to add that to my files. There's no there's no meat AI, AI but there's a lot of Drake. I don't know. We're going to see. But I don't know. I mean, I think Meek is cooking up. Rick Ross bought Meek's second mansion. Well, I heard of, he played, didn't he play a snippet of him and Ross? Ross was in the studio with him like a month ago. They, they put a song. Yeah, they got some fire coming up. I don't know their relationship either. I don't know if Meek is still signed with MMG. Did he get out the deal? Ross bought his two houses from him. I don't know what that's about. Mm. I don't understand Meek selling all his property. That's alarming, but that's not my business. So. And where's Wale? While he was just in uh, Nigeria, Elliot just posted. He been quiet. He been quiet. He ain't been on social media. He ain't been talking for like the past year. So he probably cooking up. He probably cooking something up. He was Twitter figures for a long time, and you know he getting that, like the press bag and venting, and you know. So. It's gonna be an interesting summer. Yeah. We are gonna see who's who. As far as what, just the rap game or just just, per- just the rap game period. A lot of artists are quiet. You, you say Wally's well, been quiet. A lot of you are quiet when you really think about it. Ross has kind of been, he's popping out now, but Ross has been quiet the, like the last few months or so. Wale, Kendrick is still quiet. Drake has popped out. Who else is? Jay Z always quiet. You know, he ain't really. Hmm. NBA, your boy just put out th- an album. So, <laughs> 30 songs. 33 songs. songs? I ain't even listened to it yet. When I clicked on it, I'll scroll. I was like, like double God. album. <laughs> I know them young niggas loving it though. Yeah. I, I ain't mad. He feeding the young people. 33 songs. That's a lot of goddamn songs. That's a lot of material. Shout out to him, big young boy. He's feeding them. Yeah, but back to Meek. I don't know what Meek's plans are. I'm just here for the music. I don't care about the breeze. You know, I'm here for the music. As long as the music. I think, like we said before, he need to lock in like one producer. I might need to tweet that. Lock in one producer. I don't know who were it. A hit boy, Alchemist. Whoever it is, I'm just get throwing names out. You may not want Hit Boy, but or Alchemist, but whoever it is, one producer. I could hear. I don't could know. hear with Alchemist. Metro. Metro. I don't want to hear up tempo. I want to hear like you don't want. want, scream, want you don't want screaming me. I want introspective stories. What's going on in your life? What's been going on? Type. You you older. I want. I want maybe just Blaze. Somebody like that that could bring out some real. Some good music from him. Well, he's bringing back the breeze. Why not? He why won't he just bring back John Lil oh. and Sad and all that? John Lil beat Bully Sad. Where he call him up? Why can't right? bring bring the whole wave but back? Then, then that's that's yelling me. That's you me yelling again. Yelling with the breeze is different. He he was um, on Instagram. Him and Reed was talking Reed Dollars. So he might got a he might got a plan. You know what I want to see. <laughs> I want to see oh, me shit. back with the dirty braids on YouTube with thirty niggas behind Blood, him. Doing bloodhounds, I, O'Malley. I want to see thirty frilly niggas behind him rap, him rapping. That's what I want to see. That might be the marketing plan. Hire us for this album. Hire us. You draw the braids back. Go back to North Philly and South Philly. White T, Tall T, Tall T. Get young, call young Bob. Get Reed and them behind you. Big with the big brick, my fitted hat. Oh, it's that's right the there. Plan. It's right there. It's a layout. You should do that. That's that's a good idea. That would be fire, actually. Listen to us. Listen to the people. Make make the call. Make a I'll call. I'll DM them. I'll DM them. I'll tell them. That would we be need perfect. our credit. That would be perfect. We, we need, need our credit. That right yeah. Yeah. We yeah, need that. Dope. That's different. That's different. Because I'm not mad. He went. He, you know, he went craft and all. And I, I respect yeah. that. But take it back to the essence. Come on. Take it back to when I used to see you at one stop <laughs> with, with, with Oskino. skin though. Yeah, get back with those. Do some old Oskino. Yeah, that would be fire. Yeah, Reed, Oskino, Freeway, Joe Jad. Yeah. See, but we doing a lot of looking back. Yeah, we old niggas. Maybe he want to push for. Not if you growing braids back, nigga. <laughs> if that was the case, he had that low season with waves with a do rag. Clearly, he's trying to bring back a nostalgic look too. So give us the marketing budget. We'll, we'll throw the white we'll tea it. on you. Get some dust on the braids. See, our budget, we don't need a lot with that. We'll get Eden S and, and, and Reed and all them Georgia behind you. Had. NH. Yep. Kaboom all the niggas. And we'll get you back in the YouTube algorithm. Yep. 
Maybe do a, maybe battle a nigga or something. Breakfast bars battle. Yeah, that's Get Meek to battle a nigga. That's a good idea. And bring the feeling back. Who will Meek battle right? Who do you want to see Meek battle? Any any one of these niggas. A Philly nigga. Meek versus Quilly. <laughs> I mean that would be good to see, but we gotta get Quill. We gotta get will Quilly get involved in that. Quilly's a character. He might for the right bag. Me versus Joey. Somebody, we'll, we'll make it happen. We'll see. Um, but listen to us. Give us the budget. That's a good idea. Give us the budget. We'll figure this out. That's a good idea. We don't need much. But that's all. Well, what you, what you, think you tweeted that? something. Oh, shit. You tweeted a question on Twitter. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. That I kind of thought was disrespectful. A lot of people didn't, though. As we got the fly. There's a lot going on. Summertime. Around. Is Beanie Seagull better? We're going to close with this. Is Beanie, is Beanie Seagull better than Jay Z? Is what this how, man? How do you feel about that when you first saw that? He's not. <laughs> he's, first of all, no is my answer. But he's never been. I seen people saying it was a time when, when, <laughs> when was he ever better than Jay Z? Guess who's back? Do it again. Once again, it's on. He's watched Jay-Z on every on a, song no. that he's done with Jay-Z. He watched him on, on what? You just said it? Guess who's back. I could look at my phone. Guess who's back. Once again, it's on. Maybe once again, Somehow, it's on. Somehow, was. Yeah. This can't be life for sure. Well, Scarface yeah. watched both of them, but this can't be I life. I don't know about that, bro. I feel like every song he did with Jay-Z, he was more hungrier. And I don't know why Jay-Z felt like he needed to put him in that certain pocket of like those type of beats. But every time he did those certain beats, I feel like Beanie had a better verse. Aside from like the club, like Do It Again was, that's some party, party shit. But like, on like the deep, introspective beats, Beanie watched him. I was throwing a question out there. I wasn't saying he, he was better or not. I was just asking the people. Well, how do you feel? Be, I think Jay Z might be a little bit better than Beans, a little bit. Beans is a lyricist, yo. Beans, comp- people compare Beans to uh, B- Beanie Sequ- uh to Biggie at one point, as far as like the bars. Reasonable doubt. Volume one, volume two, Blueprint, American Gangster, Four Four. You just naming his albums, yeah. Streets yeah. is watching movie and soundtrack. Beanie got the becoming, the reason. He got shit too. Benny, Benny was his. I mean, Jay, Benny was Jay artist, so it was like he was his. He was his. He was his man, so it was like he was under him. He ain't had a room to really grow to be like a superstar like Jay Z, so he didn't really get a chance to really flourish like Jay. So I mean, if Jay, if Beans wasn't this elite lyricist, he wouldn't have been signed to Rockefeller. Beans was an elite lyricist. He was. He is elite. So I feel like that's a that's a that's a easy that's a question. Is this a question? I don't know. Like I don't think it was. So out of the ordinary, like, oh, this is a crazy question. I think it's a fair question. I'm not mad at it. I don't know. The people was talking. They were talking. talking. They were talking. They was getting at you. But so I I mean, I love a good, I love a good hip hop question. I'm not mad at that. Yeah, shots of B, shots of Who. Episode nine. Another one. Did we cover everything? Yeah, I think we covered everything. We uh, I will keep my eyes open on this Drake AI AI situation. This is the AI correspondent. yeah, you know. all, all the viewers, if you got any updates or information, please add me on Twitter. Yep. So I can add it to my at case Twitter, file. We're going to figure out if Drake behind this or if somebody after Drake is one of the two. Yep. We wrapped up the hip hop board. Shout out to Hovain. Number six, Hovain. We're going to have Hovain picture on here somewhere. Shout out to Moneybag. Yo, bring back the. the the tall T culture. And while you at it, send Meek one of those tall T's. You know? We're going to see Meek in one. Um, shout out to Mason Cam, Jim, make the call. Make the call, Jim. Swallow your pride. Send a text the message. Do it for hip hop. Ice Spice still king. Yeah, that's every episode. We know she We got our it. eyes on Scar Lip. But yeah. just relax. Be slow with it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we good. We'll see y'all next week. Next week, episode nine. Episode 10 on the way, you know. Nerdnash.com, you get my Twitter, my Instagram, yep. all that. That's Legend. Up. DJ Young Legend 215. You know, you can find me on the timeline. I'm, I'm always ready to debate and argue. Yep. I block you quick. <laughs> you go crazy. 
That's it. We out of here. We out of here.